hey there uh, today I'm going to show you how to set up the rev limiter in KTM the procedure is same for Dukes and RC uh, both of the model uh, 200 and 390 so let's just <coughs> First of all, we have to use the mode button to go to the trip 2 mode. I'm already on it, but you can just press it till you go trip 2. When you are on a trip 2 mode, you can use the mode button, uh, press and long hold to set up the rev 1. Like, you have to hold it for a long. There it is. Now once you are on the RPM 1 mode, you can use mode button to go up and set button to go down. I have set it to 8950 and uh, it could be completely different for you. So you could just wait and it will save it automatically. Uh, now the settings are saved. So just turn off the kill switch and turn it on again for second. Uh, for second rev limiter you have to stay on the trip to mode and hold the set button for long time there is rpm2 i have set it to 10 500 uh, yours can be completely different as well so just use the mode button to go up and set button to go down and leave it for some time to be saved And it's done so basically the difference between the rev 1 and rev 2 is that the the red colored light here this indicates the gear shift so rev limiter 1 is it will start flashing and telling you that you have to change gear and rev limiter 2 is the when it gets constant that means that you cannot exceed the limit of revs after that so that is the difference between rev1 and rev2 thank you for watching hit the like button subscribe